turn on snapping with these options. It's important that the origin is at the bottom of the object. Now the mesh snaps to the other mesh. However, there is a gap between the two objects. To solve that, select the bottom row of vertices. Extrude it outwards and add some edge loops with Ctrl B. Assign these edges to a new vertex group with decreasing weight, starting with 1, then 0 0.8, 0 0.6, 0 0.4 and 0 0.2 for example. Add a shrink wrap modifier to the detail object and set the other object as the target. Choose the group you just made in the vertex group field. Now the detail snaps to the surface without there being a gap.